Should you put a water fountain in the southeast of your home or office? The answer is maybe. Before you place a water fountain, there are at least two important things to consider. The energy pattern in that compass section and the annual energy in that compass section. Classical feng shui calls these energy patterns and annual energies flying stars. Some are positive and some are negative, and fountains activate these energies. If it's a positive energy, that's good. If it's a negative energy, that's not good. Let's take a quick look at the annual energies in the southeast for the next few years and see what's going on. In 2012, it's the five star, which is very negative, so you don't want to use a fountain in the southeast in 2012. In 2013, it's the four star, which is positive for creativity, artistic achievement, and relationships. In 2014, it's the three star, which is negative for arguments and legal matters. In 2015, it's the two star, which is negative for illness. In 2016, it's the one star, which is positive for prosperity. Those are the annual energies in the southeast of homes and offices for the next few years. You also take into consideration the energy pattern that formed when the building was built. We call those energies the flying star natal chart. In every building's natal chart, there are nine different energy patterns, one in the center and one in each of the eight compass sections. We know how to figure out what they are by the year of construction and the compass degree the building faces. Flying star natal chart energy patterns run in 20-year cycles. The current cycle is period 8. It began in February 2004 and ends in February 2024. Many of the buildings constructed in period 8 have negative flying star energy patterns in the southeast. Let's take a closer look. There are eight compass directions, each one is 45 degrees. A building that faces the first 15 degrees of a compass direction has a different natal chart of energy patterns than one facing the last 30 degrees. To simplify this, we'll call the first 15 degrees of a compass direction A and the last 30 degrees B. Homes and offices built in period 8 facing North A have a negative energy pattern in the southeast. North B also has negative stars in the southeast. Northeast A has a negative pattern in the southeast. Northeast B has a positive pattern in the southeast. East A and B have negative patterns in the southeast. Buildings facing Southeast A and B have positive patterns in the southeast. South A and B have negative patterns in the southeast. Southwest A and B have positive patterns in the southeast. West A and B have negative patterns in the southeast. And Northwest A and B have positive patterns in the southeast. And those are just the homes and offices built during period 8. Buildings constructed in other periods will have different flying star natal charts of energy patterns. Fountains activate those energies, so it's a good idea to look at what a fountain will be activating before you use one. There's a lot more to feng shui than just fountains. Find out more at fengshuidiva.com.